What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Michelle and today I'm going to be unboxing the December ice cream box. Now this is a monthly subscription box. Um, it's $25 a month, which it's like BoxyCharm. You get five to seven full-size products, um, except for I know BoxyCharm just went up uh, to like $27.99 a month, but this one is $25 and you're guaranteed an eyeshadow palette in every box. Now they do have a smaller version, which is like I think $12.99, but I got the bigger one because I want the five to seven products a month. Um, and it has, I peeked in this one, it has almost uh, all makeup in here. It's got like one like beauty tool, but other than that, um, I'm super excited to try it. I used to be a member of BoxyCharm, but I got to where I was getting a lot of skincare products and I just didn't care for that. Like I prefer to get more makeup. Like I'm okay with getting, you know, a skincare you know every month but no more than one because I'm I'm paying the you know $25 a month because I want makeup not two eye creams in a month like what the heck am I gonna do with two eye creams like it takes long enough to get through one much less what I mean what do you need two for but anyways that's why I canceled BoxyCharm because I just I was getting a lot of skincare that I just I didn't really want so this one i got no skincare which i'm excited about and this is the december box which okay i know it's january you guys and this is december but i did order it at the end of december and then we got this huge like snowstorm we got like 10 inches of snow out here so my package has been at the post office forever and a day but i finally got it which i'm super excited about um, I would show you the box, but my postal service has to write, um, which I can kind of show you the box, <laughs> has to write like my address all over the front of it. So it's kind of what it looks like. Sorry about that. But it's a cute little box. And it comes uh, packaged really nice. It's got a lot of these little peanut things in here. My hair is getting stuck on it. So of course you get a palette, which everything's really nicely packaged in here. Okay, and this is what the palette it looks like. Oh yeah, it comes with a nice little mirror and these are the shadows. Now this is the Ruby May Cosmetics Peppermint Mocha Palette and this is $29. Look at them shades in here. Oh, I love these. I love that green and that red. I think that red's gonna be so cute. You know, I've never done like a look with red before, so I'm gonna have to uh, do that. But oh, that's cute. But today I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna do it with just like a neutral, just a neutral look. Uh, the next thing that I see in here is base blue. Base blue. Let me get my let me get my little card and see. Um, Base Blue Cosmetics IVF Collection Lipstick. This is 21 bucks. Okay. So, it just says it's a long-lasting liquid lipstick. Ooh, I'm excited to try this. I'm so glad I signed back up for a monthly uh, subscription box. Like, I really did miss getting my BoxyCharm, like, I just love getting that like ooh surprise every month and it's not bad when it's $25 you get to try things like that you would never try like I would never just go on here and order this eyeshadow palette for you know 29 bucks but if you get it in a box that you've only paid 25 for I'm good with that I can see me wearing that you guys know I like browns anyway so they are doing good already like, I swear with BoxyCharm, they would send me every red and pink lipstick there was. And I'm like, I don't wear this. And on BoxyCharm, like, you actually get to pick uh, some of the things that you receive. And you also get to do, like, a, uh, what would you prefer? Do you like reds and berries? Or do you like nudes and neutrals? <laughs> like, I like nudes. So this is the next thing that I got. This is the So Susan Skin Primer. This is $26. That's 26 bucks. Holy crap. 
It's a pore camouflaging primer. All right. Oh, it comes out like a clear jelly. It comes out like a clear jelly. Can you see that? Oh, okay. Um, it feels different. It kind of feels a little silicone-y at first, but then it kind of absorbs into your skin. All right, I'm interested to try that. Okay, then we got these things. <laughs> This is the Base Blue Snowflake Wedge Blenders. Like you guys, this was like me back in the day. I would be blending my stuff out with, <laughs> with these wedges. So I'm actually going to uh, try these out today because I haven't used a makeup wedge in forever. But, oh my God, girl, like before that, before I start using makeup wedges, <laughs> um, I used to just use my hands. I'd be like slapping it on, spreading it out, like, oh Lord. But a little bit more about the ice cream beauty box. Um, your payment comes out on the 11th of every month. Um, and like I said, I ordered this at the very end of the month, so that way I would get the December box. I haven't seen any like sneak peeks or nothing for January yet. So I'll be curious for that. But look, it's got like a little thing. almost like a little ornament. That's cute. Okay. That's so cute. I like that. I'll use it for like concealer or something today. And then the last item that I got in here. I mean, they have this stuff packaged so well, which is amazing you don't have to worry about it getting broke up and stuff just can't get it open um let's see here we go it's in another package <laughs> all right so this is the bella pierre glowing palette so now that i got the clear plastic off i will show you guys this is what it looks like isn't that so pretty um, but I did want to run over the prices really quick. So this palette was $29, which I think I already said. Um, the lipstick was $21. The primer is $26. The wedges are $11. And this palette is $50. Bucks. Like, whoo, okay. So I would say that this box is definitely worth $25. Bucks. Like, yeah, I would for real say, but um, we're going to try out everything and I will uh, give you my final thoughts at the end. So I got my hair clipped back and I'm going to try out this primer. Oh, this is really nice. It feels, um, it kind of has like a silicone-y feel, but it's not, it's not a thick silicone or anything. It's not like... Because you know how some silicone primers just feel like, oof, on your skin? This one doesn't. It, like, soaks into your skin really nice, and it just makes it feel, like, really smoothing. So, I like that. So, I got uh, my foundation done, which I just used the Maybelline 24 Hour, and that is in the shade Buff Beige. And then I used the e.l.f. Uh, Bite Sized uh, Brow Bar, and this is in Dark Brown. Now I'm going to use the e.l.f. Uh, 16 hour camo concealer and this is in the shade tan walnut. I'm going to try out one of these wedges. I haven't used a wedge in forever. It's so weird that it's dry. Are you supposed to wet these things? I never did. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, it's just so weird using one of these, but I used to use one of these wedges all the time for my foundation and everything. But I didn't used to use concealer either, just foundation. I didn't use to uh, fill in my eyebrows. Um, my eyeshadow was a lot different back then too. <laughs> I changed up my makeup game a little bit since I've gotten older. So I'll keep these for just like a backup or something. It's not something I would go out and purchase myself, but since they gave it to me, I will take it. So I'm going to go in with the Ruby May Cosmetics uh, palette now. 
and see what we can create. I already have the uh, eyelids primed. I think I'm gonna go into uh, gingerbread, this one right here, and try to do that very lightly as my transition. So just barely tapping my brush in there, putting it mostly in the crease, and then I will bring it up just because I don't want it to be too dark of a color. So this color is blending out like a dream. It's so pretty. It's doing exactly what I want it to do. It's not coming off too, too dark or anything. I like it a lot. So on the inner portion of my lid, I'm gonna go in with eggnog. And that is a beautiful gold shade. And I'm just gonna take a flat brush. Oh, that is pretty. And I didn't add anything to my brush. I'm just seeing what it's gonna do on its own. And it is, oh my gosh, so pretty. That is a stunning shade. I like that a lot. Ooh, that is so pretty, you guys. So I think what I'm gonna do is um, take the mocha shade, which is the darkest shade, and put it on my outer crease. See, this is what I love about subscription boxes is that you get to try brands and things that you normally wouldn't spend the money on because, I mean, I just, I can't see spending, you know, almost $30 on an eyeshadow palette on a company that I've never heard of or I don't know anything about. But this way, you get to try it without spending a lot of money on it. Y'all know that I love drugstore because you can get great qualities at a great price, but with subscription boxes, like you just, you cannot beat it. Like you get, you definitely get your money's worth out of it. Like at the end of the day, if I only liked this eyeshadow palette, it would be worth the $25 because the eyeshadow palette's 29. So I do like that about subscription boxes. And I wanna use that uh, chai spice right here at the top too. So I'm just gonna put that like in the middle of the eggnog color and the mocha color. This palette is so pretty. I really like this palette a lot, you guys. I love this copper shade. Ooh, I like this a lot. I think it's turning out pretty good. I'm just gonna go back with that first brush and blend everything out. So I'm gonna go in with mocha and put underneath of my lash line, just on the outside. And then I'm gonna go in with uh, that chai spice and run all the way under. Okay, so now I'm gonna go in with that um, Belle Pierre Cosmetics and I'm going to use this for my highlighter, blush, and bronzer. So we're gonna be extra glowy today. I'm gonna take this shade right here and use as my blush. I think I'm just going to uh, mix these two shades for my bronzer, and then I'm gonna use this shade for my highlighter. Now, if you don't like to, if you don't like to glow, you're not gonna like this palette, but I like to glow, so I like this palette. And I'm also gonna take a flat brush and use that shade that I use for highlighter and do my inner corner and brow bone. Okay, you guys, so I went ahead and did my mascara, my eyebrow gel, and everything like that, my finishing powder. So the only thing left is my uh, lipstick. I do like that the way that this feels on the lips. It feels like a moussey, like velvet texture. Um, it's not quite the color, but I don't know if you can... Yeah, you can build the shade up, okay. Oh, I do like that color a lot, yay. So um, let's go ahead and review the box. The eyeshadow palette, I loved it. I think that my eyeshadow turned out really nice. I love 
um, the tones in here. I really want to try that redneck. So if you want to see another look out of this palette, make sure that you give this a video a thumbs up and I'll go ahead and do another look using this palette. Uh, I really like this color. I think it's um, a pretty nice color. I like the way it feels on my lips too. Uh, I love this palette because it's all super glowy. So I like that a lot. What else did I get? Oh, um, the primer. I got the primer. Uh, so far, I'm really liking the primer, but I will let you know down in the description box uh, how everything wore today. But really like the primer a lot. Uh, the wedges, I mean, it's a cute little thing, but I mean, I wouldn't go and buy it. No, but uh, if I get in a box, sure, I'll use it. So yay, win-win for ice cream box. So leave me a comment and let me know do you like this month's or uh, i'm sorry december's because it's not this month's but last month's um ice cream box because i think that that one's so good i like that box a lot i cannot wait to get my january one now because this one was a successful box so thank you guys so much for watching if you're not already subscribed please make sure that you subscribe and i will see you in my next video bye